What did I do? What did you not do? Why do you always make me look stupid in front of my father? Look, what angle are you playing at? Hmm? Mr. Nice Guy? Is that why you're here? Listen to me. If you ruin this plan for me, I will make sure you lose everything. I'm sure you don't want to do that for your stupidity. And I think this is becoming too much for me. Oh, wait, wait. What did you just say? <laughs> and you think 100,000 naira every week and 5 million naira when the deal is done is not too much for me? Maybe I should reduce it to 20,000 naira. No, 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 no. Hey! <laughs> Listen. I will do my job. Okay, I promise. Better. Now leave my presence. You're annoying me. Go! Ha. This boy. Daddy, mm -hmm. ah. look who we have here. Mm. Good, sir. Mm. Daddy, mm. this is Jim, mm -hmm. my fiance. Yes. Pleasure to meet you, sir. And this is my dad. Are you old enough to get married and run a family? Oh, yes, sir. Yes, I am very ready to get married. Mm. Yes, it is. Interesting. How well do you know my daughter? Very well, sir. <laughs> Interesting. But I've always wanted my daughter to fall in love, get married, at least to someone of her own pedigree, you know, the same class. Oh, don't be ridiculous. Um, Jim here is also same class. I mean, look at him. Yeah. And if I may, sir, I love it when you give off chest, but you give off snooker, you only put in the right pocket. Hmm. <laughs> Imagine that. Isn't that romantic? Uh -huh. He sounds so intelligent, Eddie. And he's also very handsome, right? Mm. <laughs> Isn't he? My daughter has a birthmark on her body. On which part of her body is the mark? Sir? Well, if you claim to know someone, claim to love someone, they are someone's uh, fiance, you should be able to know part of the body of your fiance. You should know your fiance very well. Uh, Daddy, come on. Uh, why do you think that's personal? Really? Well, as someone who loves someone, you know, you should know the names they call her. I don't know who calls her by what name. You see that? You should also know her, her surname. But, uh, so what's her surname? <coughs> I'm, I'm a car. I'm a, I'm a, it's okay. It's okay. It's fine. Then. It's really fine. So, sweetheart, mm -hmm. uh, I'll leave you both to enjoy yourselves. You know? So, have some things I'm doing upstairs. So, bye bye now. I'm doing something else, let's let me finish it. Uh. Really? Interesting. How is that supposed to be? How? You tell me. You see a woman, you tell me. You're just so daft. Stupid. You tell me. You daft. Please come. Answer, jump, 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 jump. Push on, push on, answer, push on, answer. Give me a sign. Why is it just. Why is it just. Wait, where is it? Where is it? How am I supposed to be? Did you see me? Did you see me? Did you see me? How am I supposed to be? Never see it. Is that what you're thinking? You! How could you be so forgetful that you didn't even remember one simple question correctly? Why is that my fault? Eh? Wait, did you just talk back at me? How dare you speak to me with such tone? I'm sorry, madam. Sorry for your daft self. Listen, in case you have forgotten why you're here, you're here to play as my fake fiance so my father can give me my inheritance, everything he owns in my name. And if you mess this up for me, I will skin your life. I'll try to keep my end of the bargain. 
you won't have yet to make my money for I'll try my best. Good for you. Rubbish. Hey, hey, where do you think you're going to? Stay here and be a good boy. Follow you. What do you know? Hello, baby. So she insulted you again? I have never been embarrassed like this in my entire life. Hmm. Babe, I cannot stand seeing another woman embarrass you like this. I cannot. Simply because I wasn't able to correctly answer questions from her father, which obviously wasn't my fault. She never gave me answers to such questions and her father is such a mean man. You really need to change this job. Like, you have to change. Like, I cannot take this in anymore. Change this job now. I know, but you know we are still young. We don't need this amount of money yet. Like, we still have time. We can make this money later. Don't worry. I'll be fine. Remember, we need this money to start up a new life. No problem. I've heard you. I love you. I love you too. Bye. Bye. Babe, I don't mean to disrespect you or your father. But is your father that daft not to know that small boy is not old enough to get married? Hmm. That is the least of my worries, baby girl. All I know is that he bought the story, okay? And that's on period. End of discussion. Besides, that small boy can fill in double gaps and that's all that matters. Hmm? Fill in double gaps, right? Mm -hmm. But, girl, you've not told me why you rented a small boy as a fiance. <laughs> please, please, please leave that mat out, I beg. Sugar mommy. <laughs> <laughs> Sugar mommy. I beg. <laughs> Babes, mm -hmm. why don't you give a man a chance to love you wholeheartedly than doing this to yourself and your father? <laughs> Gina, are uh, you the one saying this? Like you don't know how these men have used me. Because of my money, all the heartbreaks, never. They are all scum. I will never give any man a chance. Any man who is below my standard or class can never be with me. Come Period. On, babe. Come on. You can't be judging every man that comes across you because they don't meet your standard. They are all scum, like I said. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Please, can we just change this topic? And of course. Mm. Let me offer you something because you're not ask ready. If you're going to offer me anything. Mm. Mm -hmm. Now you want to offer me something. What do you care for? Fresh pineapple. Orange. <laughs> <laughs> Problem solved. Um, <clears throat> um sweetheart. I am going for a meeting. Um, Dad. Yes. About the other day, mm -hmm. I want to apologize for everything that happened. Oh. You see, Jim has been through a lot. Losing both parents and being an only child has really taken a turn on him. But he's truly a good man. And he's the one I want to spend the rest of my life with. If you just spend one moment with him, just one more moment, I promise you, you'll grow to love him. Okay, sweetheart. Invite him over. Let him stay with us for two weeks so that I can observe and get what? to know him. Yes, dear. Has it occurred to you that you are my only daughter? All right. Priceless jewel. I can leave you in the hands of a non entity, nobody. Much less handing over the fortunes of my companies to someone that is nondescript. <laughs> Invite him over. So, 
your boyfriend told you that a lady wants to use him to play games to collect her father's money. So you agree to that? What do you want me to do? He's not my boyfriend. I have to support him. Hey, your boyfriend. Mm. <laughs> Love one titty. So, okay, because of that small thing that you told you, now you already believed in. Okay, what if he's lying? Okay, let's assume the both of them are dating. What if they are dating? Mm. Talk, not if they are dating. Your boyfriend will just leave it like that. Go for a rich woman. And again, say, how much is even the pay that the both of you agree to that? Madam, 100,000 every two weeks. Yeah. And then 5 million naira when the deal is over. You are here talking mm -hmm. nonsense. Is it 100,000, not 100 naira? 100,000, madam. Please, so. I must see. That's your boyfriend. My husband must see. Hold on. Yeah. It's not that you know. It's not that you're telling me what to leave him, but respect yourself. No, leave him. If you do anyhow, you can go collect. Hey, sweetheart, food is ready. What did you just call me? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Sleep off now. Let me quickly tell your dad that food is ready. Hey, 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 wait, wait. <laughs> what did you just say? I want to tell your dad that food is ready. God, it is obvious that you're daft. You want to do what? I can see that you want to ruin the whole plan for me. Is that your mission here? Have you forgotten why you're here? Who sent you? Please sit down here until I tell you what next to do. Hey! hey! So, if I say sit, you, you, you clearly do not see anywhere but my bed. First you enter the town knocking, now you, very soon you, you go naked and enter my duvet. Find somewhere else to sit, not my bed. Hey, 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 hey! Don't even sit there, I've changed my mind. Come on, stand here. This corner. That's your punishment for being daft. Hey. What's that look? Is that, is, that, is, that an, is that an attitude? No, no. Piss me off! One more time, you raise your hand up. Stay here, don't move. Look at this boy. Oh, yes, Ambassador, yes. I, I do appreciate it. I'll be coming in on Wednesday so that we can conclude on the discussions. Yes. Yes. Thank you so much. My greetings to Madame. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Yes, Daddy, yes. Dinner is served. Oh, dinner is served? Yes, Daddy. I thought the cook would be away for the next one month. So what's wrong? Daddy, don't be ridiculous. Of course I made the meal. <laughs> Daddy! Ah, yes, yeah. The last time you made a meal, I remember your mom was still alive. It was awful. Daddy, stop making jest of me. <laughs> well, I admit that I didn't know how to cook then, but I have improved. Oh, that's interesting. That's interesting. Okay, let's go for dinner. Dinner is served after you. <laughs> My daughter is cooking. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> uh... I don't chop now, go feel push gates, push these gates. Oh my guy. Oh mom, this food sweet though. Ah, and you won't talk at that time, for instance. Ah, ah. Eh? And the meat, eh? This food is sweet, well, well. Meat die. Ah. Come on. See, my ekaiti don't come back because I know see now only ekaiti sabi cook this sweet food for this house. Which ekaiti? No, no, it's not possible. Ekaiti, they come back in like one month's time. Mm. What do you can't they talk if now you can't know they come back again? Who can cook this food way sweet like this? 
I mean, they don't employ another cook. Kai, how is that possible now? It's not possible. They never employ any cook. Cooks are where? So who can cook the food now? If they never employ cook, who can cook the food? Well, as I did say, I'm feeding Madame we cook her. Oh, because me and you know, say, or God, no fear ever enter kitchen to go cook food. And they don't go for a lot of visitors, we just come cook food. So. Say, they hear what they talk. <laughs> say, they hear what they talk like this. Which are they talk to me? Which is, which is from you? Make I tell you something. I don't date this house day. With my dad, I don't stay. Yes, plenty, plenty years. Uh -huh. Before you even come here. Okay. Madame no even fix her. She knows Sabi boy water. Water with the go use do a camel. She knows Sabi. Now you say Madame cook this food way sweet like this. Now tell me another. Make I make make I tell you another thing. Now you now waiting waiting you pick cook. You never talk my food before. Which food? That one a food. That potty. That poison. No, you you look me for into my eye. You say you never chop my food before. I, I, I no purge after I chop him. You purge. I no purge. No be waiting. You go to chop. Take your time. I better get out. Say so you want the, you want I'm the. Idiot. Now what you mean then name you a bear? Now what you mean can do it that way for Bible? I no blame you. Idiot. Come on, you can go be good for work again. No worry, now me be your king. For Bible, I go flog you that king too. Idiot. This is so delicious. You like it? Yeah, I do. <laughs> you know, the last time I had a meal like this was when my wife was alive. And of course, recently, <clears throat> catching my cook, who's away from a man. You know, oh. you like it? I do. <clears throat> my mom taught me how to cook. Really? Yes. So you made the food? Oh, yes, I did. Mm. Uh, sorry. <clears throat> I mean, we, <clears throat> we made the food. Yes. Uh, Together. Yes, my fiance is right. He helped me slice the onions, he blended the tomato while I did the cooking. Mm. Mm-hmm. Oh, good collaboration. Produced this. Oh, nice. Yeah. Mm. Thank you, Daddy. Yeah. Enjoy your meal. I taste it. You. What did I do? What did you not do? Why do you always make me look stupid in front of my father? Look, what angle are you playing at? Hmm? Mr. Nice Guy? Is that why you're here? Listen to me. If you ruin this plan for me, I will make sure you lose everything. I'm sure you don't want to do that for your stupidity. And I think this is becoming too much for me. Oh, wait, wait. What did you just say? <laughs> and you think. 100,000 naira every week and 5 million naira when the deal is done is not too much for me. Maybe I should reduce it to 20,000 naira. No, no, no. Hey! <laughs> Listen, I will do my job. Okay, I promise. Better. Now leave my presence. You're annoying me. Go! Ha! This boy. to calm down. Calm down. I am being embarrassed on a daily basis. She slaps me every day now. In fact, it has become a daily routine. What did you do this time? What happened? Just because I made dinner and her dad asked who made it. I said it was me. Well, no, it told me that she had already told him she made the dinner. Can you imagine? So as old as she is, she cannot cook. She doesn't know how to enter kitchen. Obviously, she doesn't. Hey! So how, 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 wait, wait, wait. How has she been feeding her dad? Always buying from the eatery, I guess. This is crazy, babe. You just really have to endure, okay? There are a few days for this thing to be over. So just endure and get your money and get out of there, okay? Just calm down. Take care of yourself. I love you. I love you. Bye bye. Hey! Wow. Hey. Ha! Mama, my cat if I allow one Numa to, 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 to beat my man because of how much, how much that she can money, will not be beating my man, eh? Oh, for pity. You think I'm enjoying it, Abby? I'm enjoying it, Abby. 
I'm just trying to enjoy it so that we'll finish this and get our money and get out. Oh, please, so please. Okay. You have to endure so that you can enjoy. This is endurance. Understanding girlfriend. You said someplace I didn't even know what is wrong with your head. Gina, my dad is becoming too inquisitive and that dirty pig keeps falling prey all the time. Is it your sugar boy you're calling dirty pig? A guy you show before your father. That's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Isn't that what he is? The same guy you do things with in the presence of your father to convince him, right? Things like? <laughs> Kissing, romance. Oh, come over, stop pretending. Because I know you like him. Hmm? I like him too. Listen, this guy, he's cute, he's handsome, he's everything. The problem is, he does not have money. He's not everything, and I don't love him. And about him being cute and handsome, that's one of the reasons why I even hired him in the first place. So it would be easier for my dad to believe that he's from a wealthy home. And why are you still complaining? I thought you told me that you were going to twist him whichever way you want. I am twisting him already. I just cannot wait for all this to be over so I can put him in his damn place. Someone is giving up already. <laughs> hey, me, give up. You huh? know me. I do not give in to failure. Mm -hmm. I will surely win in the end. My daddy will win everything in my name. Bet. <laughs> I even just take it to Paris. Paris? <laughs> and you go with me? Sweetheart. Daddy. Why are you sleeping alone? Where's your fiance? Yes, I'm um, <clears throat> sure. Fiance, he went to the kitchen to get some water. Well, I was just reading downstairs. I wanted to check on you. Just hold on. Let me get him. I was reading downstairs. So how could he have gone to get water and he didn't see me? Hey! Hey, wake up! I need you in my room. My daddy is there and I want you to phone me when you play along. While you're at it, Please do not overstep your boundaries. Do not overplay your part, okay? Let's go. Hey, watch it. Thank you. Hey. What took you so long? I'm so sorry, I took so long. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm Sorry, I, I was reading downstairs and I wanted to check with my daughter. Sorry for badging. Good night. Good night, Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, Daddy. do you both have for the day? Why are you silent? Uh, couples make plans for the day. You're a husband and wife. You should have plans for the day. 
Right, Daddy. Yes, of course we have plans for the day. You know, we spoke about it in general, right? Yes, we, we did. Daddy, yes. my, my fiance is right. Mm. Mm -hmm. So you think with one mind? <laughs> yes, we do. Sure, it's true. It's good. So, Daddy, what would you like for breakfast? Ask your fiance what he would have for breakfast first. Okay, darling, mm. fiance. What would you like for breakfast? Uh, oh, fried egg, noodles. <laughs> you think too much. <laughs> ah, so, Daddy, what would you like to have? Well, I would like to have every other thing your fiancé wants to have, except the two kisses. <laughs> <laughs> okay, breakfast coming through. <laughs> <laughs> So, Jim. Yes, sir. When do you think it's time to become a man? Brilliant. So you can, uh, uh, you know, always. Darling. Yeah. Would you mind standing in the chin in this table? As you can see, I'm discussing with your father. Please. Oh, well, you 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 can join your friends. So it's okay. All right, sir. I'll be right back. Okay. Yes. Okay. Huh? What if I do wrong this time around? What have you not done wrong? Your dad asked me to make the breakfast. Shut up. Hmm? You're just busy sitting down there talking to my father. You didn't know you supposed to follow me. Enjoy your expensive couch. Oh, you're, you're miserable like Have you ever sat on such a couch before? You property street. Fool! You expect me to make breakfast for me. I almost broke my nose trying to figure this shit out. Come on, would you fix this breakfast? And hey, if you go about telling my daddy that you made this breakfast, I'll kill you. You are making this breakfast, but I cooked it. Come on, get to work. <laughs> no, you're laughing with that. Get to work. Dad, good day. Yo, sweetheart. Where are you off to? Um, oh, I thought I mentioned earlier that I would be stopping at my friend's house. Where's your fiance? You should be going out with your fiance. But dad, she's Jim! Jim! Yes, sir. Come here, Jim. Yes, sir. Jim, hey, you must always go out on social visits with your fiance so you can bond. That's agree. what couples do. And protect her because you're the man. Yes, I agree. Yes, sir. Good. I'll just uh, quickly change my shoes and I'll get out. That'll be fine. Thank you, alright? <laughs> sure, baby. I'll be in my car waiting for my fiance. Oh, yes. That's what you should do. Drive safe. You see, you get the Asuka. The 
has money. There is no grief for him. It's not that your boyfriend that you're with another woman. That's that's best they are now waiting for. Madam, so you want me to jump into the arms of another man because of car and money? Do you even have sense? This man has house. What are you waiting for? What are you looking for again? Ah, come on. You don't mean me. Auntie, why are you still here? Go and meet him now. She'll be asking her money out. Go and meet him. If he tells me I go grief, sharp, sharp. I know they don't myself. Eh? I know they don't myself. Things are not done like that, though. Things are not done like that. Let me tell you. How do you just go and meet a man? You have to know if this man loves you before you accept him. Uh, but that's that is girlfriend. Mm. If you love me. Okay, it's love that I want to eat. Now, love me, I want chop. It's love that will pay my own bills. It's love that will pay our house rent. It's love that will feed us. I see I'm whining. I beg, why is Jerry? Grief for this man. Grief. Hey, hey. Ah! She, 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 I'm whining. And I always feel that you're waiting. The best time you're waiting. By this time next month, you will just see that they're they already married. They'll be living a happy life. No, oh, Allah. And I'll be waiting for, 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 your, for another boyfriend. Thank you. Brother. Thank you. I'll wait. You wait. Mm. You wait. Yes. You wait. I don't understand. Get down to her. I don't understand. You want to follow me to where I'm going to or what? When did that one start? What? This is in the middle of nowhere now. I don't care. Just get out of my car. Are you serious? Hang around somewhere. When I'm done, I'll come and pick you up. Are you, are you serious? I'm dead serious. Out. Now! Get out! Serious? Get out! Get out! What is in the middle of nowhere now? Get Really? Oh, I don't know. It's fine. Ha. Can you imagine my dad telling that small boy to be following me around? How now? <laughs> it's not funny. <laughs> You're joking, right? No. So where is he now? I don't know. I dropped him off. Did you drop him where? In the middle of nowhere. Probably he will find his way home. Or better still, go back to his dirty neighborhood. When I'm done, I'll go and pick him. Listen, babe. Do you need to start doing things that will convince your father that you both are in a relationship? I think from the look of things, you're still having doubts. You think so? Yes. <sighs> My daddy is just a hard nut to crack. Exactly why you shouldn't give him a chance to feel with the gameplay. I mean, you have to be romantically involved with Jim, especially in his presence. Ew! Yeah. Expect me, Steph, to be romantically involved with that small boy. No way, it won't work. Then you're not ready to get your father's will. Mm, I missed you. But I'm surprised, I didn't know you'd be here by this time. Man. Come on, just need to stop by to come and meet. Check on you. Finally. Finally, want to check on me. I'm so tired, like everything that's happening is just got into my neck already. See, I just had to calm down. No, just calm down. But seriously, my friends are being insulting me. They used to laugh at me. I don't like it. My friends are mocking me. They say a lot of things about me. Blah blah blah. This, that, this, that. Oh, I'm calm, not happy. Calm down. Let's just relax, okay? When will all this, this thing end now? It's for the greater good, yeah. It's for our future. That's why I'm doing all these things. It's for the future. Just endure for now, and I mean, everything will be fine soon. Enough. I'm tired. I cannot enjoy you. I'm tired. Yes, and there's no pain in the game. You get it. You have to endure now and enjoy it. You understand? All the cash I just made, I will be doing right. You get it. Mm, this is fine. Mm -hmm. Now that you're here, mm -hmm. you can make some things. This is what you should be saying now. Yeah. What do you want to eat? I need to be fine. Yeah. Which one is yeah. the noodles? My Yes, now. I don't take that. You can prepare something like that. Alright. Stop! <laughs> Stop that right now! <laughs> ah! Daddy! <laughs> Stop! So, Daddy said. Sorry, Daddy. I, I hope you're enjoying yourself, I can say. <laughs> yes, Daddy. Enjoying yourselves? Mm -hmm. Are you jealous? Why would I be jealous? <laughs> Come on, get out of here. <laughs> I think I forgot it. Now, she's me. Hey, 
Behave yourself. Sweet, we did. Don't come to me. Stop! No! No! Yes, welcome back. Baby. Yeah. Where have you been? Who told me where you were going to? I'm sorry, I stepped out. This is a surprise for you. Oh my god. This is for me? Yeah, baby. You didn't have to spend this much money buying it. Hey, this come one. on. It's not compared to the love I have for you. <laughs> you know what? Let me shower. I'll come down so let me see, alright? I love you. I love you too, baby. <laughs> Dad. Yes, sweetheart. I can see he's taking good care of you. I see. Can I have some? Oh, daddy, I want to check them out. <laughs> My favorite lotion. I can see. It. Well, I can safely say that you love my daughter. Do your parents know about your relationship with my daughter? Well, first of all, sir, I want to say thank you for seeing my clean heart towards your daughter. It's all right. It's okay. <sighs> my dad died a few years back. Oh, dear. Cold hands of death. My mom could not bear the heartbreak, so she passed away a few weeks after. Oh, I'm sorry for your loss. So sorry. So sorry. It's fine, Dad. It's fine. It's all in the past now. Well, every man goes through that, and once you overcome that, you become a man. So you become a real man now. <laughs> yeah, speaking of which, you know, in those days, um, I used to have a formula. <laughs> you did? Yeah, for win women. <laughs> I wooed them and I got them. I never failed. I mean, uh, I can wonder you look this good at your old age. <laughs> wonder how you're looking for years back. <laughs> you need to share that formula with me, sir. Ah, no, no, no. <laughs> Age is wearing it that way. Uh, it's just going. It has nothing on you, pa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 by the way, I, 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 I don't know. How were you able to arrest my daughter's uh, heart? Uh, same old, same old. Ask her out. You know, wear that couple of times. Really? <laughs> that's okay. Well, you tell me your formula, Sha. Uh, but that's the same formula. No, it's, it's just that. <laughs> It's just that it changes with men. But hey, it's the same for... Hey. Uh, Daddy. Yes, dear. Has How are you? Having fun? I need some father and son, you know, thing. Yes. That's what it is. You know? <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, dear. All right. <clears throat> so, well, that's the way it is. And I'm glad you succeeded. So, that's the same formula. Oh, really? <laughs> that's the same formula. <laughs> Okay. It's the formula. It yeah. doesn't quite change over time, really, but 
It depends on the individual. Mm -hmm. How you able to apply the laws? So the laws are the same. Okay. <laughs> same laws, different people. Exactly. <laughs> That's the way it is. I'm sorry to cut the excitement short. Yeah. Daddy, I would like to borrow my fiance for a minute. Please, can I have a word? Right, right now? Yes. Now, now, now. Now. I'll meet you upstairs, don't worry. Mm. Now? Yeah, now. Please don't keep me waiting. Sure. <laughs> well, I think she's getting jealous. Oh, we better like that, you know. If since the time of Eve, um, you better go and meet them. Catch you later, Dad. All right. Uh. Hey, baby. should remind you why you're here. Because the manner at which you're bonding with my father is becoming worrisome to me. But bonding with your dad is part of the reasons I'm here, right? Shut up! Who made you the game setter? I set the game while you play along. It's fine, I'm sorry. Shh, wait for yourself. Come back. What are you discussing with my father anyway? Have you suddenly gone dumb? Talk to me. I'm sure you're discussing about me. No, no, not at all. Not at all. If I find out that you're talking about me to my father, I will skin you alive. Is that why you're here? You, you think you came here to bond, right? Please get out. Know your place in this house. Know your place. Respect yourself, oh. Come in. Oh, Daddy. Sweetheart. Daddy. Where's your fiance? Oh, uh, I don't know. Maybe he stepped out for a walk. Oh, well. He's, um, he's becoming a real man now, you know. Uh, I could marry you. What man are you talking about, Dad? Sweetheart. How many men are in your life? Daddy, mm -hmm. just one. Why would you ask that? <laughs> well, I think he's a man, and um, hmm, I think he's worthy of you, you know. Yeah, but how come you're not planning your wedding? Why are you silent, sweetheart? Um, wedding. Mm -hmm. Oh yes. Um, Jim and I talked about it, but he insisted he would talk to you about it. First. I'm just surprised that you're already thinking towards that direction. Well, you're on the right track. You know, sweetheart, um, as the only daughter of a man of means like me, I want to organize a top-notch wedding, you know, commensurate with your social status. Um, Dad, about that, mm. I, I don't think my fiancé and I would want anything flamboyant. Mm. Just want it low key. Well, well, it's okay. Uh, since both of you have agreed, I only need to support. Uh, <laughs> Thank you so much, Daddy, for understanding. Right, my darling, come on here. Mm. Mm. Okay. I love you. I love you too, you know that. Yes, Daddy. Oh, okay, so just uh, tell him I walked in. Sure, Daddy. All right, bye bye. bye. Oh, baby girl. Hmm. Honestly, this calls for celebration. <laughs> it shows we are a few steps close to achieving our end. Gina, hey, 
You don't know how happy I am that I cannot wait in all this drama. And um, most importantly, you have to be very careful during the marriage. Because once you mess it, you won't be able to amend it. <laughs> how do you mean? What I mean is that do not allow Jim drink the palm wine you'll be giving to him on that day. Because if he drinks it, you both will be married forever. Over my dead body, I can't even make such an expensive mistake. Are you sure? Okay, no problem. Secondly, I think staging an elaborate marriage won't be advisable. I have to lie to my father that him and I had already talked about the marriage, but we do not want anything extravagant. Just a low key wedding. You did? Yes. <laughs> I see you and I have no deal to say big of What are friends for? <laughs> My girl, I'm so happy for you. <laughs> All right, get to work. Hi. Hi. Um, I hope I didn't disturb you. Well, I was busy, but it's fine. It's okay. It's okay. Um, uh, well, I just wanted to tell you that you're a very kind-hearted person and Anytime I come to your shop, I just appreciate the fact that you always give me your time. And since I started coming to your shop, I just always feel this connection and strong bond between us towards you. And, and I can't even explain it. I really appreciate you for like finding me attractive. But the truth is I have a boyfriend and I don't want to cheat on him, and cheating is not even an option. Uh, uh, I am not saying you should cheat on your boyfriend or leave your boyfriend. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm just saying is, just give me small space inside your, your heart. Please, that's just what I'm asking. We are saying the same thing. We are saying the same thing. My heart is occupied by someone else, so sorry. Linda, you're making me feel bad. Okay, let us do this. Can we be friends? Are you okay with that? Okay, fine. I'm cool. I'm cool with it. Alright, I have to go back inside. I was really very busy. Like you need to go now. Okay, fine. Let me just let me get money for you. It's let me give you lunch money. No, no. no, I just have it here in Thank my pigeon. You. Are you sure? I'm fine. Thank you. I'm serious. Okay. Alright, bye. Alright, take care. <laughs> hey. Tomorrow is the day. Do not mess up. Okay? So listen and listen. Truly, carefully. Because if you do anything contrary to what I'm about to tell you, I will make sure you leave this house without a dime and everything you have worked hard for will just be in vain. Hmm? Okay. First thing first. Tomorrow, I will dance to you with a cup of palm wine. Do not drink it. I repeat, do not drink it because I do not want to be traditionally married to you. Just pour the wine away, put money inside, then we'll go for blessings. Okay? Yeah, could you please start from the top? God! I know you are daft, okay? But please, please be your best behavior tomorrow. Be smart just for tomorrow, okay? You can go back being daft after tomorrow. I said, listen carefully again because I am not going to repeat myself again. I said, tomorrow, Dance towards you as tradition demands with a cup of palm wine. Throw it away. <laughs> now that so it's like pour it like that. The whole world know. Stylishly pour it on the ground. Okay? Then just bring that money from your pocket and put it inside. Is that okay? Yes. Have I made myself clear? Yes, I understand. You better understand because you mess up. Ha! I will not only make sure you do not leave here with a dime, I will also lock you up. 
because I cannot lose my inheritance because of your stupidity. What about your parents? Your family members, are, are they coming? They're coming tomorrow. They better come, okay? I don't want anything suspicious. <laughs> Daddy. Hello. That you mm. used to do something, eh? It's used. You mm. produce something. Well done. Well done. Um, <clears throat> um, it is well with you. Yes. You shall continue to grow. Yes. You shall multiply. Yes. You shall reach the highest high, yes. bigger than us who are your parents. Yes. You shall touch the sky, yes. and whoever comes in between you, hey, hey, I won't tell the person what happens between the ant and the firewood. Yes. <laughs> You know exactly what I'm doing. First of all, don't drink the palm wine. Then all of a sudden, drink the palm wine. What exactly are you doing? Hey, hey! How dare you speak to me like that? Have you forgotten who the boss is? I decide what to do and when you do it, okay? What just happened? Hey, this boy is I'll cut it off for you. Steph, how could you make such an expensive mistake? Knowing the implication of Jim drinking the pan wine before the elders. No. I don't know what came over me. It just happened. I, I can't believe this. But I warned you. I warned you. As if I knew this was going to happen. Now what do we do? Tell me, please. Nothing. Nothing? Absolutely nothing. No. We can't turn back the hands of time. There's, surely there should be something I can do. They did. He's done. I cannot be traditionally married to Jim. I cannot. There has to be something. Please. Surely there, there must be something we can do. There is nothing we can do. There is nothing. It is sealed. There has to be something. Yeah, I'm so confused. There I has, don't even know. There has to be something. Just come up with something. Anything. Ah, nothing, nothing, nothing. Please, just don't do that. Don't leave that. What is it now? So about all we've been through, you still have the God to stab me in the back. It's not what you think, I promise. You see, let me tell you. She forced me into drinking that, that, that wine. We discussed about it. I was not supposed to drink it, but she, Daddy, she don't pressure me to drink it, I promise. No. It's not what you think. It's not what I think. It's, it's not intentional. You mean that, listen. See. Hear me out now, listen first. If you dare, if you dare talk to me again, you'll see what I'll do to you. I did this thing for us. There is for us, I did it for us. For us? Yes. Which us? You did it for us. Or you did it for your selfish sake. 
You did it for yourself, not for me. If I had known, I would have listened to my friends. They, tell, they kept on telling me. I stood by you, spotted you. I hear you are telling me for, let me watch here for ourselves, for us, what you do say. Don't see, I even vexed me. Get out of my sight. Linda, Linda. So you are enjoying this, Abby? You are seriously enjoying this, Abby? I know you are enjoying Abby, they don't marry your boyfriend. Boyfriend, you know, see. Money, you know, see. What's it going get? Nothing. Is it my fault? Is it my fault now? Eh? Because I said, let me support him. How is that my fault now? Sorry, understanding gay friends. Now you don't shop breakfast. Now what do you want to do? What do you, what, what do you want me to do? Follow Jude. Which one is follow Jude? He's not a man like like like, like Jim. He's yeah. not the same kind of man. See this guy has been asking you. Just follow him. Leave that you all use let Jim. We don't need him. He's a married man now. Just leave him. Follow Jude. Jude is a single boy. Just follow him. Now he's already married. He's a married man. You don't drink for one, you don't marry, they don't do it together in here. But what did I do, eh? I don't deserve this. Mm. I gave him my all, I gave him everything. I stood by him, I supported him. And this is not fair. Mm. This is seriously not fair. How could he go and drink that palm wine? I so now by right, he's traditionally married to that girl. That girl. I feel pity for you, sorry. You don't cast. Last, last. Now everybody go show breakfast. Shall you stop this nonsense? Do, do, do. Hello, I'm outside. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Hello. Am I? Um, I hope I didn't disturb you. It's fine. It's fine. Because I don't, I don't want to always seem like I'm always disturbing you. It's okay. I was actually going to get lunch, so I decided to come get your own order. Ma'am. Okay, yeah, thank you. That's a tough one of you. Okay, I'm uh, fine. When I'm almost at the restaurant, you can just send me your what you want, your order. Okay. Alright. Linda, I love you. I really do. Please give me the chance to show you that I am the man for you. I am the one for you. And I want you to love me too. And I promise you, you will never regret it. Please. I'm scared. You're scared? What are you scared of? What? All men are the same. Oh, come on. Come on, don't say that. All men are not the same. Just because you've met... One or two guys that hurt you or broke your heart doesn't mean we are all the same. I am different. Are you sure? I swear. I swear I am different. But even at that, I don't know you. And if we were to do anything, it's just be like a blind love. And well, you're you're right. But I always come to your shop. Always. And by the way, you know my name. And uh, if you must know, I am the managing director of one of the biggest agrochemical companies that is situated at the business district. So ask me anything you want to know. Ask me anything else. And I'll tell you. That'll be all for now. Are you sure? So is that a yes to me? Love. 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I can't do this. Why? What did I? What did I do? It's not about you. It's. Linda, I'm, I'm sorry. Linda, I'm sorry. Linda. I'm sorry. Linda. Linda. Should I still get the food? <clears throat> uh, Jim? Oh, sir? Where's your wife? Uh, she's resting. Taking a nap. My daughter that I know doesn't take a nap. <laughs> I made her take a nap. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Alright, you get the cars ready for me. Um, I'll be traveling. Okay. You take care of the house All and right, the right. business, is okay? All right, sir. All right. All right, sir. We should be having something beautiful together. That was all I wanted. But you made Mm -hmm. I'm sorry for everything. But the way I've been treating you, I know I've been awful towards you, but the truth is I've just been trying so hard to fight my feelings for you. I'm truly sorry. Please forgive me. I promise you, forgive me. I will be the sweet, loving, caring wife that you've always dreamt of having. I give you peace. I'm sorry for everything. Come here. Look, I forgive you, right? You do? I will just be impatient. I need you to come around sometime. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> So I was saying it's very interesting for you, do you want to see it? Oh, so just forgive me. That was easy. Oh, easy? Yeah. Well, I should have been more <laughs> talking. <laughs> Somebody tried to be more. <laughs> love you so much. I love you too, baby. So. Mm -hmm. Honestly, Gina, I can't fathom the feelings I'm beginning to have for Jim. I don't even understand it. How? What do you mean by that? I don't know. I, I have these strong feelings for him and it keeps growing each passing day. If the feelings grow stronger, I think I'm falling in love with him. What? What, what are you saying? Stay, what is wrong with you? This is not the stay that gives to love. When did you become this vulnerable? I don't know. I don't even understand it myself. Each time I close my eyes, I 
and sleep at the same in my dream and I wake up wishing that it was back to me. Is that normal? What's wrong with that? L- listen, the earlier you kill whatever feelings you have for that guy, the better for you. Else, you kiss the real good. It's over five days after the wedding, and you don't want to wait. You want to wait. Please, be patient, okay? Uh, listen, I'm out to patience already. I need my money, and I need it now. Like right now. Please, I said be patient, okay? I'm just trying to convince my dad to reveal everything in my name. And once he does that, you'll get your share. Listen, I keep my part of the bargain. It's left for you to do your part. Why are you delaying? Why are you wasting time? I know. Please be patient, okay? We have done the work. All is left for my dad is to do the need for which is to send everything in my name. I don't understand your frustration. Feel free to stay here until you get your money. Please. Jim. Babe, listen. I'm so sorry. How long will you keep on being this quiet? Say I'm sorry. What are you sorry for? Listen, the day before the wedding, she specifically told me not to drink the palm wine. All of a sudden, the day of the wedding, she forced me to drink it. Here you go again. Here you go again. She forced you to drink it. Did she force it down your throat? I was in the middle of the crowd. Honestly, all eyes was on me. What was, what was I supposed to do? Oh, Everybody was looking at me. I, I, I was caught in the middle of, of everything. So wait, oh, what is her aim now, forcing you to drink that palm To convince her father, of course. To convince her father. Listen, you have to believe me. You have, you have to believe me. I've tried to explain this thing over and over and over. I just don't just want to understand. No problem. It's okay. I believe you. What is, what is no problem when you believe me? Believe me. Love you, and I'll never do anything to hurt you. Oh, yeah, cross your heart. Cross my heart. Are you sure? Yeah. So, you. Hey! Hey! Where are you going to? I'm um, off to see my friend, any problem? What stupid friend is that? Hop in, you're following me. When you start ordering me around like this? Hey, if you know you want some money, you will hop in now. I said now. Abel! Abel, get the gate! Was that his for me? <laughs> see that this boy just. Hello, babe. More things just get not to hand in this place, I swear. How do you mean? Do you know that this girl took me to one of my boyfriend's house and forced me to cook? She has not only, only told me to house help, I'm now cooking, doing all the house chores for her. What? Well, I am happy she took you to her boyfriend's house. That shows that she's not, she's not interested in you. My mind is now at rest knowing that I have no one to contend with over you. Come to think of it, why hasn't she given you the money? Even after fulfilling your own side of the bargain. I swear this is the height of humiliation. Honestly. I'm sorry, honey. What are we going to do about it? Ah, I don't know yet, boy. I just know that everything is going to be over soon. It's going to be all in the past, okay? But you can't continue being a toy to your madam. I don't like the way you're sounding. Don't go and do something stupid, though. Hello, are you there? Babe? Hello? <clears throat> Jim? Sir? Now that you're my daughter's husband, it's time I let you into the family businesses. And of course, improve on your personality, right? 
So to this end, I've arranged some special trainings for you so that you get to know the kind of businesses we do. Oh, wow. Thank you very much, Ah. Mm. I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. It's okay. You're not just my in-law, but you're now my son. <laughs> so I need to teach you how to take care of my daughter and then how to manage your own family. Yes, sir. You see this training? The earlier you started and how fast you are will determine how much of information you'll absorb and how you can get integrated into the business. All right? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, I think... Uh, I need Jude. Now, where is Jude? I don't know whether the uh, car is ready now. should be outside or something. Because I should be out now. Is the car ready now? Jude! Find out. Find out uh, what's happening. Now be that way, we won't smack at my door. Open this gate! Ah, uh ah, -uh, madam. Now who is the fine? I'm here to see Jim. Jim, Jim, you know, I know tell you. You this witch. You this witch. You don't want to respect yourself. Oh, so you have decided to turn my boyfriend into your toy, Abby? Um, who is this mad woman? What are you doing here? How dare you walk into my company and insult me? Are you mad? Shame, you know you don't have shame. You don't have shame. I am doing you a favor here. But you have decided to turn my boyfriend into an errand boy. And who the hell is your boyfriend? Abel? Abel, is this your girlfriend? Come and take her away from me. What are you doing here? Really? What are you doing here? What is wrong with you? What exactly is wrong with you, Linda? If you allowed them into this compound, right? I will soon sack you. You are lucky she's not your girlfriend. I will sack you and arrest the both of you. You let her in again. Die. I told you not to come here. So you expect me to sit down, fold my arms, and watch that in quick? I'll treat you. I remember clearly. I told you do not do anything stupid. Here you are. No, no, no. Here you are. See, I'm only looking out for you. Not for me. I, this girl father was about to make me the MD of the company. I, if I swear to God, if I lose this money, I will never forgive you. What's wrong with you? Why don't you appreciate anything I do for you? Appreciate what? Why appreciate don't you appreciate what? anything I do for what you? What are you doing? Coming to spoil things for me here. If I lose this money, if I lose this money. If that is the case, then I'm, I'm sorry now. Sorry, I'm sorry, sorry for yourself. You're sorry that you're going to give me this money, Abby. Sorry for yourself. I'm sorry now, babe. I'm My sorry. Friend, I'm doing, doing, I'm doing, I'm doing, what, what do you want me to go to now? I don't, I don't go here. Hey, babe! Babe! Come back here. I don't go here. I'm not going anywhere. Better come back. Babe! Come back here now, no! Babe! If I, if I, if I, if I give him one slap. Babe! No problem. You will come back and meet me. I will not even say anything. Hey. You. What? So you have the guts to allow that lunatic, that, that dirty fool to this house to humiliate me, right? How dare you? I will not allow you to refer to Linda as dirty, lunatic. What's wrong with you? Mind your language, Wait, Steph. What are you talking back at me? Have you lost your mind? Listen, I will not condone you calling her names. Dirty, lunatic. I will not condone it. Mind your language. Are you mad? Hey, what just happened? Hey, so you no longer talk back at me. You not defend yourself when I'm about to hit you. When did that one start? Hey! Hey, you know what? I know how to deal with your kind. Jim! 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 Come back! If you know what I see for this compound, what happened yesterday? What happened? Now, one small girl, that's what the girl called him. Get me, be, 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 he entered this. He finished, madam. He, he, he sought madam. I don't even understand what he did. Talk. So, what did she say, madam, did to her? Hey, you know, say me, I don't go understand. Nana, big, big grandma, she just they use, just they finish, madam. They give madam left, right, left, mm, right. You know, saying right. big grandma, I don't understand. So, what is the essence of you giving me this gist if you give you, if you don't have the full details of the drama? I know. I make it that. I don't blame you, Nana. Me carry my two legs. Come, come, give you gist. You get gist, you know, free complete gist. You my car key. Come open that gate for me. In shoe, like flying boat. Nonsense. 
Just one, give me this. Give me this. Give me this. Give me this. Jim, Jim. Yes, sir. Mm. So, Jim. Yes, sir. Sit down. Oh. So, how is the training coming up? Uh, it's going well, thank God. Any hitches? Just a little. <laughs> you know, uh, life is not a straight line. So, you must meet some rough patches. But then, the more you pay attention the more you do it, the better it gets, right? Yes, sir. That's true. Okay. Um, I'll soon be traveling. And I'll leave you in charge of the house, the company, and then uh, my daughter, your wife. And then I know you'll be man enough to manage all this. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. Well done. Yes, sir. Linda, what exactly are you doing here? I just have told you not to come here again. Now, what's wrong with you, Linda? What's wrong with what am I doing here? What does it look like? I am here to stay, whether you like it or not. Linda, you know what is at stake here. Mm -hmm. Why are you coming here and I want to spoil things for me again? So you're trying to say you're not happy to see me? That's not what I'm saying, Linda. But you know what is at stake now? Hmm. Let me tell you. Me, I am tired of meeting you. Whether you meet me or not, that one is your business. Eh? I don't have time to spend with you anymore. You just leave me all, the, all, all day alone. So what do you want me to do now? Ah, me, I want to go inside, but as you can see, me, I'm tired. I'm already stressed out. I'm thirsty. Let's go inside. If you don't want, stand there. Me, I'm going. I don't want to go inside. Linda, oh, do you need me? How many times have I told you not to let that dirty girl into this house? What is she doing here? Listen, with all due respect, I've told you for the opposite time now, do not call Linda a dirty girl. Wait, do not. Wait, are you, are you raising your voice at me? I can see you're beginning to feel bossy over what my daddy said. Now listen, go to that room and tell her to leave this house. Let her pack all her stinking things and leave at once. Listen, I'm not here to drag your father's property with you, okay? If Linda leaves this house, I leave too. Do you understand? Jim. Okay. It's just that bringing her here will ruin everything. Will ruin your whole character. If you want to do what I understand, what if my father finds out? I fulfill my part of the bargain. It's time to fulfill you to fulfill yours. What are you waiting for? Huh? Jim. Where you go? I want to drop Oga at the airport. Mm. Yeah. Ah, so if you say Oga don't travel, yeah. Ah, that means say it's a better, better case. Oga will carry come back when he come back here, Abi. Hey, you know that girl? That girl what they say? He go, he go insult Madam. Yes. Now so I did hear oh the girl just knock again, big, 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 big. I open gate, now so she enter with her bag. Immediately, Ogaji me just run come outside. He drag me come here. I just come out. They begin to shout for their say, "Bitch, bitch, 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 bitch." You know, say me, I don't like to put myself for inside. I know, I know. So, what's gonna happen after that one? If you ask me, now what I want to ask. But this one with this girl boldly carry her bags, mm. come enter this house mm. to come stay. Is that she's related to Oga? Or she's related to madame, or even madame's husband. See, me, I know even know. I know, no. But I go tell you the truth. Mm. If it be, say, that girl now, or guy, I will match begin. 
You know, say, oh, God, is all those people they play away match. Where, 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 where? That's your soccer man. Shut, shut up, your man. Now you they follow and go play the match. Now you being coach. You think they worry this one? That's why I don't like to follow you. They talk important things. I forget that. Nonsense. See, shoot. Flying boat. Nonsense. See, hope you're not thinking you're going to sleep in that girl's room today. Why are you making life so difficult for me? Eh? Oh, eh? You must lie to me. You're not sleeping there this time. Let me just tell you for your information. Oh, yeah. What do you see that? It's a madman. We are doing. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Uh, leave me alone. 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 Leave me Hold your waist and be tender. You can't take away the pressure. Well, I can't be a thing. So, run up, Nebuchadnezzar! Dude, stop running. Why are you running? Come back. I've seen you already now. Eh? See, I have been monitoring you anytime I come here. But before I want to see you, you just disappear into thin air. See, there's no point lying. There's no point. If you had told me that you are a driver, Okay, fine. There's nothing wrong. I would accept that. Even my, my man here, he's, he's not the boss of this house. But still, I accept him. I'm proud of him. So why the lie? You can't lie that you work at agro chemical industry or be... I don't even understand what you were saying. Well, I... I used to work there now. I, I just got fired recently. He just got fired. <laughs> well, you'll get fired here too if you don't answer your boss immediately. Which one my boss? The small boss or the big boss? My boyfriend, Mr. Jim. But I was... <laughs> I was a big boy, you. <laughs> you were a big boy. No problem. <laughs> nah, you, I, I, was a, I was a big boy. Not, I used to you work there. You were a big boy. Yes, now. Okay. okay. That's, that's, that's what it's like. That girl away, I tell you, say, come here, come insult madam. That she be that. Eh? Why you can't they dodge that girl away, I tell you, say, insult madam? Nothing. Nothing. Hmm. So why you can't see him, you can't dodge? What if you, what if, what if you, what, what, what if you all this nonsense now? It is a man no see you. What's wrong with you? Why you behave like a woman? No woman ain't they like her, but I say nothing. Ah, ah. Okay. I go to watch you, my eye day your body. Eh, uh, big brother. You they watch me. Mm -hmm. I go look bush. Doc Fowl.
Jane. <coughs> I got this for you. I'm sure you like it. You got me gifts. Mm -hmm. Since when did I want that? Come on. I haven't gifted it in a while, so I decided to just buy you something nice. Come on. Check it out. The cost of action. Well, thank you very much. I don't need it. Why? Please accept them. This is from my heart. Jeff, please, I'm the only son of my late parents. Don't use my duty to ask I beg. I will not. What are you saying? This is from my heart. Okay? Just have them. Feel free. <laughs> Baby. I'm so sorry for the way I've been treating you. I'm really sorry. I know this is supposed to be a game. But I've come to really like you. I've grown so fond of you. You being here has made me realize that I've been fighting myself. Please forgive me. I'm willing to do anything, anything to give you for you this. Let's take this seriously. I mean, I believe there's something here, don't you think? We can do this. We can have a beautiful life together. You and me. You can even live here for as long as you want. I love you. Oh, so you think buying my boyfriend clothes, perfume, wristwatch will make him fall in love with you? Abby? <laughs> Uh, please, please, please. Let me just remind you that it was only a game plan. But you're here lost him over my man. Let me ask you one question. Did he ask you to gift him? Yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't lead at me. Don't lead at me. Let me give her the peace of my mind. Let me tell you something that you do not know. I am my boyfriend. Hmm? I've taken a blood oath. So he's never leaving my lip. Never leaving me for you. Well, let me tell you something you already know. Mm. Jim and I are traditionally married. How about that? <laughs> traditionally married. <laughs> so you think I don't know that you forced him to drink that palm wine? Yeah. Oh, you think I don't know? Please, please, please hold it there. You think I don't know? You don't know you are, you're already a loser. You know, I, I cannot that is what sit you are. here you're a loser already. You, however. You're getting old. Say, you're old already. You don't even know how to light the gas. I think the only thing you know how to do is to boil water. Yes, that's the only thing you know how to do. You cannot do anything, please, just go. Keep running. You cannot run. That's the only thing you know how to do. Keep running. Nonsense. Linda, I don't, I, don't, I, don't know, I don't know what to tell you again. Can't you see clearly the devil is using you to ruin my plans? Can't you see? You just allow yourself let the devil not use you. Oh, so now the devil is using me. The devil is using me now, Abby. Clearly, can't you see? Me that is trying to help us. The devil is using me now. I don't know what I mean. No problem. I will not say anything again. Just do what you want to do. Linda. Rubbish. Please, please, don't Linda me. Yeah, hello, Chief. We are at the airport now. Oh, thank God for safe flights. I will send you to come pick you up now. Yes, sir. I'm sorry now. I'm sorry for the way I spoke to you. I did not mean it. Please it's fine. Know. No, no, it's fine. I forgive you. I Are forgive you, sure? you. Yeah, I forgive you. Are you sure you've forgiven me? Don't worry, yeah, yeah, I forgive you. You're not even looking at me. I forgive you. Yeah. Jude! Jude! Yeah. Where is he about to be from, sir? Jude! Where's Jude? Yeah. 
what is he doing inside? I'm calling him. Oh, yeah, no. Don't be, don't be. Why is he not answering? I don't know. See, you're my sister. Here, for now. You understand? Which sister? Now, now, for here, you know, it's before we find out and calm down. Okay. Yeah. Do the sicko. Ah. When did that one start? Body they shake. Now this morning he starts. He don't even take mess himself. Oh, okay. guys in the airport. He has to go and pick him up. Ah. So we inform him now. Okay. Yeah. Jimmy. Mm -hmm. For me. Are you blind? Did you see her father standing there? Or just standing there display your madness? Baby, I'm sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. What will sorry do now? Will you fix it? Okay, what do we do now? Let us hear you say we. We. We don't fix this mess. Or else. Fabish. I'm very sorry, sir, for the drama my sister caused. Yeah. She is not your sister. I've always known. Since the very first day she brought you into this house, I knew there was a game plan. I just decided to tag along. Oh, he's here. Daddy. Mm -hmm. ah. Look who we have here. <laughs> Good sir. Mm. Daddy, mm. this is Jim, mm -hmm. my fiance. Yes. Pleasure to meet you, sir. And this is my dad. Are you old enough to get married and run a family? Oh, yes, sir. Yes, I am. Very ready. Mm. Yes, yes. Interesting. How well do you know my daughter? Very well. Interesting. But I've always wanted my daughter to fall in love, get married, at least to someone of her own pedigree, you know, same class. Oh, um, don't be ridiculous. Um, Jim here is also the same class. I mean, look at him. 
and my lace are not very much as well. It's a good sneaker. You need to put in the right pocket. Hmm. <laughs> Imagine that. Isn't that romantic? He sounds so intelligent, Eddie. And he's also very handsome, right? Mm. <laughs> Isn't he? My daughter has a birthmark on her body. On which part of her body is the mark? Huh? Well, if you claim to know someone, claim to love someone, or someone's uh, fiance, you should be able to know part of the body of your fiance. You know your fiance very well. Uh, Daddy, come on. Uh, I think that's personal. Really? Well, as someone who loves someone, you know, you should know the names they call her. You know who calls her by what name. You see that? You should also know her, her surname, my dear. So what's her surname? <laughs> And the and the car I'm not it's okay, it's okay, it's fine, then it's really fine. So sweetheart, mm -hmm. I'll leave you both to enjoy yourselves, you know. So I have some things I'm doing upstairs. So bye bye now. I'm doing something upstairs, let me finish it. Are you married to the young lady? No, sir. You're not? No, sir. Get up, go. Get up, go. Thank you, sir. Jim's sister has ruined everything, or should I say Jim's girlfriend has ruined everything. Even at the moment we are trying to do them love. Your love? Yes. I fall in love with him. I love him so much. I know I've been mean to him. I've done terrible things to him, but I just, I just wish you forgive me. I just wish you just forget everything. His love would be the consolation. I don't even care about you. My dad is real at this point. All I care about is winning him over. Really? My friend is in love. So, listen, what would be with me? If he truly loves you, he will certainly come for you. Love is meant to be reciprocal. Come on. Surely you really need it. Real? Come on, stop it. Stop. <laughs> Take it easy on yourself. Jim, Steph, I'm sure that when you started this shorai, you never knew it would come this far. You never knew it would turn out this way. 
I have watched this nonsense happen in my house for some weeks now. And I have decided to put a stop to this nonsense. Jim, I took you into my home and embraced you as a son. I gave you all the opportunity necessary for you to grow. I exposed you to my businesses. I introduced you to people that will make you become a real man. And I think you have become a real man. But at this point in time, you must take a real hard decision. In front of you now are two beautiful young ladies. One of them is my daughter. The time has come for you to make up your mind as to where you're going, what you really want. And that time to make that choice is now. You've got to make this choice between these two ladies and end this charade right now. The choice is yours. First of all, I want to say thank you so much, sir. God bless this day. Thank you so much for everything, all the opportunities you exposed me to. You've been nothing but kind and good to me ever since I came to this house. You would always remain my father. I've known Steph for a while now and she has brought out the part of me that I, I thought didn't exist. I was finding it very difficult to find myself. She brought out the man in me. She taught me how to be bold, how to be outspoken, how to get what I want. And it's Linda. Linda brought so much joy to my life. Just taught me how to be patient, how to trust. Most importantly, how to love. Right now, I'm faced between two choices. Make it or lose it all. But if I'm going to lose it all, then I'm going to be a fulfilled loser. So, sir, I choose Linda. What? Steph. 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 Uh, Jude. Sir. Get their bags down. Put them in the car. Jim. It's interesting knowing you. You have proved yourself uh, a real man. Um, against all odds, you have actually surprised me. You have actually proved to me that you're a real man. Um, I'm impressed, actually. The five million you were promised, I'll make it 20. For you, sir. Yeah. Um, you can set up some businesses, manage them, and take care of your home. I thank you for your sense of discipline, truthfulness, and of course, responsibility. And you have shown me that um, there are still men out there. So, congratulations. <clears throat> Thank you so much, sir. Um, my daughter and I uh, are pleased. Um, we will get by. And I wish you all the best of luck. Thank you so much, sir. I really appreciate it. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Congratulations. And you, young lady. Congratulations. Okay. Say hi.
Jude? Yeah. Take them home. Bye bye. Bye bye. Come here. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Come and sit down. Come and sit down. You are worth more than anything. You are beautiful and rich. The future doesn't have any limits. It is not good to get anything by lying, by slate of hand. It will never be sustainable. So don't worry. You will get whatever you deserve in life, okay? All right, my love. Cut now. Now, clean your eyes. I don't want to see any hair on your face. You are beautiful. You are rich. You are powerful. Whatever you want. Thank you, Dad. All right, my love.